Welcome back to Prey. It's time to head to the power plant. Bunch of nests in there. Oh. Oh, come on. It's like staring right at me. It knows. I'm actually kind of surprised the telepath doesn't just automatically know where you are since it is a telepath after all. Experiencing power related issues in your workplace, contact that person. So I can just throw that inside. There we go. Oh, shit. Some of them made it out. <laughs> They're so fun to play with. Such a cool enemy. Good cop, good cop. Excerpt from a book on interrogation techniques by Dr. Avalon Bayer. The typical interrogation suspect portrayed by... Hmm, I feel like I've read this. Yeah, yeah, I've read this. The majority of suspects want to talk, let them provide some prompts. Starbender Cycle Book 5 Crown of Tumbleweed. You can read this if you'd like to. What the heck is an ancient phone like this doing on a space station? Turn to dial? Like spinny dialer thing? Don't know what they're called, but... Oh my god, look at how realistic that dent in the metal looks. That's amazing. That's beautiful. That's a beautiful dent. Coming through. you're in control.
Q-beam cells. Oh yeah, I've gotten another upgrade kit. I've got two. Let's go ahead and upgrade this thing some more, actually. Let's get the power up. How are we looking on neuro mods, by the way? Three. I guess I probably want to save up for the next level of lab tech, right? Yeah, I think I'll wait for that. Something just like instantly saw me, I think? Aperture cleared. Operator deployment resuming. Oh, well, I think it's inside there, so shouldn't be able to get me if it did. Why did that move? Oh, this is that creepy, like, telepath. No, not telepath, but, uh, uh, like, poltergeist thing noise, isn't it? There's probably one somewhere around here. Oh, this is the, uh, person that I said to go see if there's power issues. You were looking for me? Yeah, uh, what's the story on Michaela's office? I filed an incident report. Oh, I'm sure it's a page turner, but I don't have time. I need to get a crew on the other side of that breach. So what's the problem? The problem is it's blacker than my butthole at the bottom of a well in there. <laughs> the grounding resistor malfunctioned. Swap a new one and you should have your lights. Is that all? Hey, you sound rattled. What's up? I tried replacing the resistor yesterday. And? And it just melted into some kind of goo. It smelled like fried ass. Shit, man. That's not in the report, is it? I need to get some sleep. My shift's over anyway. Maybe you'll have better luck. I remember what feels like lifetimes ago finding one of these things and not knowing what to do with it. What I don't remember is where it was. It feels like it was really far away. Hmm. Narrow mods. Three of them. Oh! <laughs> Maybe I should go to the lower floor before going in there. Doesn't seem very safe, huh? Oh, so you could repair this one if you had to repair three. Yeah, that's not happening. Systems operational. Place is massive. I've seen at least two robots. Parts storage. I hear I hear a mimic.
Aha! Uh -huh. Found one of you! Oh, there's many of you! Oh, these are powerful ones, too. Or at least this one is. Nope, they all are. Actually, nope, only some of them. Force that locked. Is it right outside? Just cleared pretty much the whole room. <laughs> wrench fabrication plant. Oh, I can finally get a wrench. I'm so excited. Moving up in the world. Oh. Can't believe that one stayed quiet. I mean, not literally stayed quiet, I just mean, you know, didn't move with the rest of them. Keep thinking there will be secrets on the tops of these shelves, but there never is. Oh, is that? Oh, I think that's replacement things. A bunch of them. Yeah, oh my god, tons of grounding resistors. Alright, good. I don't have to go back and get that one particular one, I guess. Thank god. I wasn't even sure if it was possible. I don't think you can take items that you just carry into a different uh, load zone. right here. Ah, oh, no, look what I've done. Maybe it's down below. Maybe it's like just below the floor on the lower level. Before we go down, while we're here, let's get this thing installed.
Okay. Um. I'm not really sure what that did. Well, turn on the lights in here. This was completely dark. Uh, this still doesn't open, though. Well, I guess it'll do something for us down the line. Yeah, that's still locked. Did they put a jump scare in? I think they put a jump scare in for the plants. Alright, let's go down. So it sounds like it's here. It might be up there. Little compartment that you could get up to. There might be like a cache there or something. Tough to get up there. Damn, even Morgan can't fit in there. that I was hearing then. Still hear it. Still here. I don't know. This is strangely empty. Oh, Q beam self fabrication plan. I can make ammo for that thing now. manner a few weeks ago. Yeah? Was it an ass-kissing bird named Krasikov? Maybe. Care to elaborate? Not if I'm going to get my pee-pee slapped. Worse. I'll dunk you in the eel tank. Ouch. 
Nah, supply was out of parts, so I borrowed a glue gun from the guys in hardware. Worked out okay. Ingenious. Next time, let's make sure we have enough spare parts to do the job right. Roger that, boss. Puzzle solved. Alright, just a big circle. <laughs> what? what is it? it just like went through the wall. My other item. Sad. Okay, now I've heard someone told me to try something out that I had for some reason never thought of. Evidently, you can use the recycler charges to take out heavy pieces of cargo that you need leverage for. Don't know why that never occurred to me. I don't know if I can set it off by shooting it. <laughs> Look at that. Oh, that is so cool. 0 0.2 synthetic material, 0 0.2 mineral material. Not much materials, but that is fine. Oh, back here. Right. That's the room I was just in. Yep. Oh. What the? I accidentally grabbed onto that pipe. Uh, telepath is right up there. Just outside the window. Yeah, it really doesn't seem like there's much of anything to do in here. I must be missing something. I must be missing some doors. I, there's no way I've been everywhere, right? I've been everywhere up here. Um, let's look up here and see if there's like a stash or something. There's gotta be something up on these pipes, right? Seem like it. Alright. There's gotta be more down here. Like, what's this? Have I been here? I just came from there, didn't I? I did. Right? Yeah. I must be missing something. There's no way this is everything. There's just, like, nothing to do here. Makes me think that maybe I'm... Not really intended to be here right now, and I'm supposed to come back later for a quest. Oh, wait. Ah! There we go. Cooling chamber. Alright, that's gotta be it. Up that way, reactor core, airlock, and med bay. No! Go close! Go open that right now. Huh? Morgan. What? 
Holy shit, someone who's alive? Uh, one sec. Morgan? What are you doing here? I thought you were Earthside. I'd get up, <laughs> except for my legs, and my lungs, and my nervous system. Don't look surprised. Paraplexus, remember? You warned me. The boosters are in my office. No way I'm getting there now. It was locked down and the hull was breached. No power, no air. And don't you dare try and get them. It would just mean both of us would die. And I don't need you protecting me anymore. Oh, I'm totally gonna go find them. <laughs> oh. Talus 1 exterior. Okay, so I get there from the exterior. Oh, um, three more neural mods. That should be enough for the next level of... Lab tech. And I've got three more left over. Any kind of smaller stuff I want to get? More stamina? Eh. I mean, moving faster is good. Okay, yeah, let's move faster. Let's upgrade this thing even more. Let's go with firing time. <laughs> I still haven't used the Typhon lure. Do you think I can stop it? <laughs> That's so cool. Hands on electronics. I think I've already read that. Hmm. Radiation warning for in there. Engineer. Med Bay. Check the Med Bay, see if it's small or some huge. Oh, fucking shit! Well, that jump scare worked. Contact a qualified engineer. <sighs> what the? Look at that blood. <laughs> That's bizarre. Before going to the reactor core, um, I think I want to try to get her medication. So let's go to the exterior. Let's knock out all the other quests as well. Mm, 
Where is it? Oh, I never did open the cargo doors. I couldn't... Oh, I couldn't get there. Yeah, I couldn't get there. That's right. Ah, there it is. You don't remember her, but she remembers you. She hid her condition to work aboard Talos-1. When you found out, she should have been sent back to Earth. But she made an exception. I'm not sure if that makes you... responsible. Now. She won't last long without her medication. It's up to you if you want to help her. Microgravity detected. So, the Arboretum airlock is the only one I have not unlocked. Oh, Josh Dalton's there. Do you think they could just be floating in space? No, they're they're in the guts. Oh shit, there's a time there's a time limit. I mean it's two hours, but still. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Alright, we got a couple problems. Um no items around here. I don't think I can throw anything. I think I'm going to have to just snipe them. Now it's not weak to laser beams, so I guess I probably shouldn't use the laser gun against it. Yeah, I'll just use a null wave. And it sees me. As always, I have no idea where the body went. Oh, nest. Let me see if I can grab an item real quick. use that to upgrade I don't know I guess my glue cannon that's not the right one yeah incapacitation rate to 225 percent Miguel, could you please help me locate Jean? Uh, I don't know how to pronounce that. I know she's not on your crew roster, but I asked her to come down from life support to check on the power converter for the climate systems. 
We'd been getting complaints about faulty AC all day. She went down a couple hours ago, but I haven't heard from her since, and I can't reach her on transcribe. Ask her to keep my eyes out. I'm sure she'll turn up. Mika, we need to talk. Try drop in my office when you get a chance. From Morgan. What the? Some weird rendering error. Booster shots. Got him. You got them, didn't you? Mm hmm. Oh, you make me so mad sometimes. You'll never listen to me. Let's check in here real quick. So this is the other side of that door I saw. The I think it was three narrow mods, right? That's just two. I guess there was only two. Secrets? Aha! Damn it, not breakable. I desperately need that Psy Hypo. I've only got 47 left. Oh god. Get in there. Ah, whatever. It's just a side hypo. Let's get her the medicine. Morgan, you surprise the hell out of me sometimes. Please, right at the neck. Just look for the marks. It was harder when I was doing it myself. Oh god, I can breathe again. And feel my legs. Still have some spots in the eye, but those should clear up. Thanks, Morgan. System alert. Repairs no problem. needed. Please contact a qualified engineer. I can walk. Thanks, Morgan. Hello. I was fighting to nice breathe there for a bit. 
So, um... Is that it? I feel like we should do something. Like, shouldn't we, like, <laughs> make a plan or something? Or discuss what she's gonna do next? Or just like, okay, bye. Fend for yourself. I don't know what I would have done without you. System alert. Okay. Repair is needed. I feel so strange. Feels like we really should talk more. Diagnosing superficial injuries. Nothing a portable medical can handle. This won't take long. There. All better. All right. Let's go to the reactor core. I wondered how you would react to finding Michaela. You risked your life to help her. It makes me think the neuromod extraction didn't erase everything. Not completely. Perhaps particularly strong memories still leave faint impressions. Intuitive feelings. Or maybe you're simply more compassionate than I expected. Are you sure it wouldn't have been better to... I don't mean to be insensitive. But when she finds out you intend to destroy Talos One, she might react strongly given that there's no way off the station. Yeah. Yeah, we'll see what happens with that. No power. Hmm. I can help you. Repair is needed. Please contact a qualified engineer. Well, I think that's kind of it for this place, it seems like. I don't think I can really progress further in this whole place without... Um... Without getting further in the main quest, I guess. I mean, it was back at the, the guts. Remember the quest I, I had to open the... What was it? open the cargo door, but I don't think I can do that because the area where it was had... it was like locked by some people that were still alive and inside or something like that and they didn't want to let the monsters out or something of the sort. I'm not sure what it would take to open those doors. I could go back there and check, but I don't think anything's changed there. I don't see why it would. So, I guess... hmm. I can only think of a couple things to do. Either go back all the way where I came from to go look for Josh Dalton in the guts, or I could... I mean, let me just follow the quest marker here and just see where it takes me to find Josh Dalton. Maybe they are on the exterior, even though I'm pretty sure they're not, but uh, I'm gonna try. Made it to your office, Morgan. I haven't been here since... I believe it was the time where your medical condition was discussed, Chief Engineer Ilyushin. What the hell?! Morgan, is that- I am January. Morgan Yu's personal operator. Talk about loving the sound of your own voice. All right, January. Is that Morgan's workstation? And the fabricator? Morgan, come up here when you get a chance. Chief Ilyushin, please do not- <laughs> Okay, so she did go somewhere. Meet them in my office. It just, it's very strange. I feel like they just should have said that at the end of the conversation. Just a little something, you know? Like, hey, okay, once I start feeling better, I'm gonna make my way to your office. Or something. Just something. Um, anyway, the thing for Josh Dalton is taking us to the shuttle bay for some reason. Not sure why. Maybe that's the easiest way to get back to the guts? Uh, not sure. But uh, I'll bring you back when I find something new. Oh, I think the cargo bay door is open from here. Back at the original panel on the outside. Now which door is the cargo bay door? Is it? Yeah, that one. Okay. Maybe this will take me to Josh Dalton.
Decent supplies. Three canisters. Okay, so I've checked all the canisters. I'm losing hope that this is going to take me to Josh Dalton, though. I don't know. Let's see if this opens. I don't think it will. No. I think that's it. This one doesn't look like it'll open either. Oh, Josh, how do I get to you? Alright, well, while I'm here, since I'm so close to those people that wouldn't let me in before, I'm gonna try going to them again and just see if anything's changed. Alright, let's see real fast. Nope, unpowered, locked. Yeah, alright, I gotta come back here later. Let me see if I can find Josh in the guts again. Alright, well, I couldn't find Josh Dalton, so I'm gonna do the go back to my office quest. And to do that, the fastest pathway according to the quest marker is to go through the Arboretum. So I'm going through uh, some access to the Arboretum from the Guts shaft. I don't know if I've been here exactly, so that's why I'm bringing you back, just in case it's somewhere a little bit new in the Arboretum, because I haven't fully explored the Arboretum at all. I guess I've been here. The body's looted. Oh, and a little bit earlier I recycled a bunch of stuff and got ammo for all the weapons I care about. And also got a bunch of neuromods, so I've got six more now. I'm kind of running out of things to spend them on, to be honest. Things that I, you know, care a lot about. Uh... <laughs> I wonder if anybody's done, like, a... A no neuro mods all wrench run of this game. And just like Well, I mean I guess if it's no neuro mods you couldn't put neuro mods into this. So maybe neuro mods, but this is the only skill that you can use them on. Pulverize. Just get really good at the wrench. Anyway, let's see. Stamina, eh. I mean more health would be good. Walk and run without making noise. That'd be pretty cool. Better sneak damage, also pretty good. Hmm. I guess it's one of those. Could also save up for a better combat focus. Um, let's get stealth. Yeah, so I was looking at some of the other things, by the way. I have quite a few quests for the crew quarters. And I was looking, and it looks like the crew quarters are actually accessed through the Arboretum, as well as deep storage. So, uh, I think after I do this quest to go back to my office, I think all paths forwards, whether it's optional quests or main quests, takes me through the Arboretum to either the crew quarters or deep storage, which is for the main quest. Oh yeah, I remember this place a little bit. I 
have to go through here to continue, I think. Yeah. Yeah, this is where I first came into this place. Alright. Well, I've already explored this. Ooh. Run! Let's hope the nightmare doesn't return when I go to the lobby. Wouldn't be surprised if it did, though. Haven't seen it in a while. The main lift that I opened up. Oh. Never looted this person. Hendrik Devries. Hendrik Devries' office! That's the office I tried to get into, for, like, forever. Back in, um, the trauma center. Well, well, I've got another thing to do back in the lobby. Alex! Damn it. Hold on. I'm encrypting the rest of this. Hmm? New quest? Yes. What? What's the objective? Ah. Which I'm guessing is in their office. Okay. Okay, either I'm just not that good at getting every single flower around, or these keep growing back? Which is it? I just don't know. Alright, where's the trauma center? Other side. Oh right, there's something in the trauma center again. I remember that when I passed by it. But I had no reason to go inside it, so I didn't care at the time. Now I do. What do we got? Hello, are you here for an appointment? Maybe, I didn't see you there. Maybe it's not here. Maybe it's just nearby. Is this person still passed out? Oh, uh, wait. Where did that person go? Uh oh. That's creepy. 7324. Assuming it's for safe in Devry's office. Diagnosing superficial injuries. Nothing a portable medical history handle. I'll have you feeling better soon. Good as new. Contact with qualified engineer. Yeah, guess they're just not in here. They somehow, like, saw me, even though they're apparently above me. Alright, let's just go take care of them. They're freaking me out.
Kennedy School of Sciences. Three narrow mods. Eh, nothing I really want to spend it on. I could do this, but I'm not having trouble with health. I don't know, more effective make it, sure. Excerpt from Cellular Society, The Social Repercussions of Medical Technologies. Yet the effects of medical technology on society's norms can be more pronounced. To cite a recent example, one only has to recall cigarettes. Uh, cigarette use was often frowned upon as a habit until advances in the food industry that allowed for consumable microspheres that captured and expelled cancer cells from the body. Simultaneously, both the fear of cancer and the stigma attached to smoking vanished within a generation. Now smoking is perceived as no more harmful than drinking a soda. Morgan's Psyche Vows. Hendrick. Find your psychological evaluation. I uh, need you to remove all sensitive material regarding the psyche valves immediately. Of special importance are Morgan's log sessions. I need those materials in my office. From this point forward, only speak through an encrypted transcribe. I've sent you the decryption key. You should be able to download it from your workstation. From Alex. Subject for quarantine. Hendrick. Trevor Young is one of our scientists. He was exposed to our inner containment area without proper protection. He's gone through observation in psychotronics and has had his most recent neuromods removed as a precaution but we'd like to keep them under more standard quarantine until we can be certain there are no lingering psychological effects. Okay. Listen to it. Can I... I just can't press L. I've got to go back to it. Morgan's breakdown off his computer. The last copy is hidden in his office. I'm not going back. You'll have to get it yourself. A C B A C. Good luck. Dr. Cole's office Talos one lobby. Isn't Cole's office just like Yeah, just right here. I can help you. I'm pretty sure I searched the whole computer, though. I wonder if it's related to the behavior test answers. Probably. Yes. ACBAC. ACBAC. Yeah, it's got to be this. A. C. B. A. C. Aha. Uh -huh. That's... Odd to tie a password to your, what, assistance answers? That are just gone. I've been listening to the Hello, logs, nice reading the research, you. playing catch up. Do you know how many times we've had this conversation? This is the fifth time. Does it always go the same way? 
Not always. Victim alert. What does that mean? Repair is needed. What Please do you think it means? I think it means you should be concerned as my counselor. You left yourself a message. Would you like to listen to it? No. I think it would help. I said no. That's not me. Why do you say that? I don't know. I just know. You agreed to this. This was all your idea. Yours and Alex's. I didn't agree to any of this. That... Morgan is not me. I would ne... Do you know what's going on in Psychotronics? Do you? If I did, I couldn't say. You know that. What do you know about the Typhon? <laughs> we shouldn't talk about them. Not without your brother present. Them. You do know, you snake. How can you sit there? Morgan, take a deep breath. Here. I don't want a pill. I want this station shut down. I want Earth... Morgan! I said no! <sighs> okay. I'm going to call Alex. Welcome. Maybe I can help you. All right, let's go to our office next. Oh, this isn't the way, is it? What did I think this was the way? Is my office on the other side? I think it's up there. And Morgan did not share anything else about me. Not even... Only the details of your condition, Miss Solution. And only because they might place the station in danger. Morgan, hope you don't mind. I was using your workstation. Chief Illusion ignored my request to desist 13 times. <laughs> Alright, got a chip from something. I don't even know how I got that. Blows that would otherwise kill you will leave you with one health instead. Five second cooldown. Oh, that is amazing. That is very amazing. Uh, let's see, which one do I want the least? That's good. Definitely good. Definitely good. Definitely good. I guess performing a sneak attack restores some health. That's kind of meh. Oh wait, what am I doing? I have these two slots here. And no need to tell Morgan about the 14th time, January. I took the liberty of restocking your supplies. Found some food on the way up, left it on the desk. Don't worry, they're alien-proof. I checked them, no twitching. Chief <laughs> Illusion is correct. There are no Typhon Cacoplasmus present. Oh, thank you, January. I haven't been in here since you were lecturing me on my paraplexus. Thought for sure you were going to fire me. Too bad you were sweet on me. I could tell. Aww. I never told you why I altered my medical records. I know you were so sure when you were lecturing me, Morgan, saying I was selfish and... My father, he was imprisoned for questioning the Soviet intervention in India. Many prisoners are lost in Siberian labor camps, but my father vanished. The only thing I knew for certain was Tronstar was recruiting volunteers from those labor camps. I came here because of you and Alex and your experiments to find him. And now I know he was here. I noticed on your computer. You found a set of names and ID numbers from Psychotronics, from Dr. Gallegos. The Russian volunteers were never referenced by name, but I was able to match an ID to my father. We can pull up his records. Archived experiment logs. I've already asked a great deal of you, but if you could find that archive in deep storage, I'll finally know what happened to my father. His name was Yuri Andronov. V01065532. Morgan. Whatever we find is not going to be good. 
security station in the lobby might have weapons. Okay, well, I think that's a pretty good place to end this episode. So, I hope you've enjoyed so far. And when I return, I'm going to finally go back to the Arboretum. And try to find my way into deep storage and or the crew quarters. <laughs>